Hey everybody, welcome to Tech with Brett. Today I want to show you how to download all of your iTunes music to your computer. This is a really simple process. The first thing you need to do is to go into iTunes. Once you have iTunes loaded up, you need to make sure that you are signed in with your iTunes account where you have purchased your iTunes music. Uh, you can do this by going to account or you should see a sign in button at the top of the screen. Then you'll need to come over here to the iTunes store and over here on the side, on the right sidebar, all you have to do is scroll down and find the purchased link. When you click on the purchase link, this will pull up all the music that you have purchased from iTunes. If you have a family account, shared account you will see the different people and who purchased the music so here if I click on my music I then have all of my songs here and I can click on them and download them individually but if I want to download my entire library all I have to do is come down here to the bottom right and click download all this will begin downloading all of the music to my computer so that I have full access to it and I can load it onto my different devices and listen to it right on my computer without there being an internet connection. Is where it's putting this music is if you go into your file browser and here I'm going to go into my music folder and then here we have iTunes and we have iTunes Media and Music and this is where it is downloading all those tracks to so here I have uh, the new YouTube album on there and then you'll see these other bands are downloading as um, in the background and it's putting these in these folders then I can just copy this music to wherever I want. I can now go through here and check to make sure that all my music is downloaded and then I can easily plug in my Android device and copy this over or just use this music offline and I don't have to worry about logging in to iTunes to get there. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Tune in next time where I'll show you how you can upload this music to your Google Play library so that you have it stored all on your Google Play account without having to load up your computer to listen to your music. Thank you so much for watching. Hit the subscribe button and the like if this helped you out, and we'll catch you on the next one.